Former bodyguard makes startling claims about Buster Rhymes, calls him super zesty and alleges exclusive fun boys club section. What are y'all thoughts? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Have a wonderful day, and I will catch y'all on the next video. Oh, yeah. In some of your videos. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Super Zest Monster. For sure, bro. That's my thing, bro. Like, this been common knowledge, though. Like, all my promoter homies would always say, man, you know, we got to bring some, uh, we, we, we got to bring some, what they call them, uh, I'm not gonna say it over here. They call them uh, fun boys. They say we gotta have some fun boys in the section for Buster, cause you know I, I, I bodyguarded for Ghostface Killer before. You feel me? And being around him, you 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 hear things. You feel me? I'm like damn. And my auntie like the biggest Buster Rhymes fan. You feel me? Like every cookout she planned it. All his little fast rapping, all of that. Him and Craig Mac playing that bro on my soul i'm out with a group of people at this time um, i was with uh don benjamin you familiar with him no i never heard of him model dude like a model guy he was doing like some rapper and stuff his name don benjamin i'm out with don benjamin and the club we ended up going to Busta rhymes in there so he got it was a little lawyer guy that was with us and the little lawyer guy we was with, you know, he was a gay dude, super cool, feel me, good guy. Bro, Busta Rhymes wanted him in his section so bad. Like, what? <laughs> Pulled him to the section, like through the roof, and tucked him off in the corner. So I'm looking like, well, he ain't come with us. Well, I know he was in the little group. So if I go out with somebody, like a group of people, I try to make sure everybody get there together and leave together. No, he stayed with them. He stayed in there with them, bro. For sure, bro. You ain't never heard about this before, have you? Bro, that's common knowledge, bro. Like, if you in the mix, bro, if you in the mix, like I've been in the mix, you know this, bro. How long has it been like this knowing about Buster Rhymes? Well, I knew about this like in 2012. I knew about this in 2012. How can we think nobody else speaks up on it or says anything? Because, bro, these people admire these people so much. They want to make sure they in the section, they at the club, they at the video shoot, they can get backstage. That matter most, most of them. That matters so much to people. It's crazy. Like, but if you notice, like, it's countless videos of Buster Rhymes getting mad at females for just being girls. This girl touched him one time, he'd go crazy, throw a drink on her and everything. See what I'm saying? Like, what? Why are you getting mad at females? You go to these guys, they're in the club, go to their section. It's all men in the section. That ain't weird to nobody. I'm going to the bar, sorry. Text me if it get dangerous. But there's all this club security in here. Like, nothing's finna happen. Nobody wanna kill you guys, bro. Like, when I get jobs from people who really got a threat on their life, I move way different. Nobody wants to kill these entertainers like that, bro. Like, when I do my threat assessment, there's never an immediate threat of danger. It's never, it's never a situation that they're gonna tell me, oh, this person wants to murder me. Or this person wants to bring harm on me. It's never like that. Them type of people be normal guys. So, I hear somebody say, oh, he's cute. I want him. So, when I heard that, I turned around like, man, did he just say that? Well, you got all this jewelry to attract some men in here? You was wild. Shocked me. But so enough. And that, that was the guy the Buster Rhymes pulled back? He pulled him into, pulled him into the section. Pulled him into the section. And then they walled him off like, like, this man, I'm like, damn. And that little dude was so happy, he couldn't believe that. He was shocked. But, man, you ask, bro, anybody that's in the mix, bro, like, you know, bro, most of these dudes, bro, putting on a major act, they don't want to be themselves. 
That's crazy. They'll get mad at you for buying bottles of champagne to get the girls. They'll get mad. Oh, we don't want these bottle rats in our section. What are we here for? What, what, what are y'all here then? What are y'all here for? Just because y'all got booked to be here, okay, but sometimes they not booked. They just in there. So, and what they looking for, it ain't going to be what you're thinking of. Oh, God. Hey, beautiful souls, it's Shakira. Thank you for tuning into History, Channel News, and for all your incredible support. Can't wait to see you in the next video.